focus and engagement towards a handler not towards all people but towards his handler that's what's important so don't misread it as he must now learn to engage and focus on all people it's about teaching him to focus on you guys whoever handles Hachiko at home as the leaders and then myself as the trainer he's learning to focus on a handler so this is what we're working on today i'm letting him just defuse first you know we want to make sure that for the puppy that we're training in a very positive way this is all new to him you can't correct it or corrections are a necessity it's needed but you cannot correct a dog that doesn't yet have knowledge of what you're asking them to do so i wanted to defuse smell around a little bit see the camp almost get a little bit bored in here because the goal today is we need to be the most exciting thing in this camp he's got a lot of dogs over there and right now for a young puppy his value for dogs is incredibly incredibly high and this is what we want to start balancing out so we're going to see today how he starts finding value in me as a hand i'm going to ask for small bursts of focus not asking for distance control or anything yet just wanting him to learn how to switch off pressure on the leash by coming to me and that is a huge positive for him so he starts learning from a young age coming to a handler on a recall is great that's what we're working on today good boy good boy so even clipping on a leash in that moment must be positive so now he's going to go off and now we're just going to work value back to me as the handler so from here i'll ask him now hachiko come yes good boy yep. good and coming to me gets a massive reward good boy break and now he can go off on his own again good good hachiko come yes buddy good boy super break now we move again good 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 Walk out the line, walk out the line, good boy. Yes, good boy, super, super buddy. Good boy, good boy. Yes, good puppy, already nice behavior that we see. Good boy, that's good. So you'll see minimal commands being used. We want to not to have to rely on constant, constant commands. One command should be enough. So at this stage, we're more just building mechanics and value for the things we want. So I'll do a small recall. Hachiko, come. Little pop there. Yay! Come, Hachiko. Yes, good puppy. Super. One more, because we've got nice value now. Good, how's it going? Come. Yay! Good boy! And break. That was absolutely perfect. All that we found today was Hachiko found value in the handler, and this is great where we're ending the session. He's now sitting next to me, and he's slowly starting to figure out, wait a second, there's massive value in the handler. So this is how, from a focus point, we're gonna start seeing him able to engage and focus, and we set him up to learn positively and confidently. There'll be times where we'll have to correct behavior, all those kind of things, but the beginning introduction into the training is fun, it's exciting, and he's now here, not because he has to be, but he does, technically because of the line, but the line's loose and the dog's staying. That's what we want to see. He's got all the dogs behind him. He's confidently sitting with his back facing them. And he's just confidently found where the value lies. And it's within us. 